Okay, guys, it's update time. Um, I've been waiting to do an update. Uh, I wanted to wait until they sent me my rain kit, my waterproofing kit uh, from the Momotion website. It cost me 10 bucks, and it's taken two months to get it. Yeah. So anyway, what you get is you get this little membrane, all right? This little membrane... Uh, it just it's simple it's a peel and stick membrane that goes over the control buttons on top of your luba right there and you just peel this off and stick it on there clean it up first before you you do it so that's that uh, seal can stick on on the on the cover there now the other thing that they do is uh, they send you this Rain cap for the RTK. Now, as you know in previous video, I have mounted my RTK up on a pole real high. And uh, so I'm going to go get a ladder and we're going to snap this thing on. I think it literally takes two seconds. But uh, one thing I wanted to address in this uh, in this update is that, uh, uh, you know, I'm a, I, I do the Reddit uh, community notes. And, and I'm, you know, I'm fairly active on social media with uh having a bad hair day with respect to uh the motion the luba um and i see i get updates when people ask questions and when they post uh you know about their problems they're having their malfunctions and and you know i must have gotten lucky because uh literally within one hour of having this thing out of the box and in operation in my yard, uh, uh, this thing has performed flawlessly. Uh, it has cut my lawn, which is roughly point. Well, I'll show you here on the map. This is how much, how, how many square feet it is. It's not much, and. Uh, I've had no problems, and I've cut approximately variations of different cuts. I've used the efficient cut. I've used the uh, custom cut. I've used them all, actually. I used the high grass cut. I used all the programs, and I have probably sent Larry. I call him Larry, by the way, if you didn't know. By the way, I had to peel off the L. I had to peel his L off, so I got to make him a new a new name tag. Um. Yeah, I had to pull, pull that L off to uh, put the membrane on, the little weather membrane on. So anyway, I'm going to make another name tag for Larry. But uh, I I watch all of these people struggling, and, uh, and, and I have to say, mine has performed literally without mistake since day one. No positioning issues. Uh... I haven't even replaced the blades, and, and uh, it it cut my South Florida grass weed hybrid lawn <laughs> at least fifty times, and I cut it on the two point four inch setting, and I send Larry out about twice a week, so I don't know fifty times maybe. And then sometimes twice in one day, I don't know, a lot. So now that uh, rainy season's over and the grasses and, and the weeds are going dormant, I'm going to change the blades and uh, I might put Larry in the garage. Now, you know what? I'm going to leave Larry out here. I'm going to leave him out here. He's under this thing, you know, like I showed you in a previous video. He's well protected. So I'm going to leave him out here on his charging station. And uh, I might send him out once a month until rainy season starts again, until the, which is next June. And, uh, you know, see how it goes. But uh, I, I, I pay attention to all of these blogs and, and, and all of these Reddit posts about the Mamotion Reddit posts. People having problems. I would say 90% of them are user error uh, and you just gotta 
get to know the thing and you got to find the little tweaks and tricks in the app and you got to be smart like uh you move the RTK, well, you got to start over. Um, you run over something and high center luba on a on a stump or a toy or piece of concrete or a rock or something. Well, that's that's your fault. That's not the machine's fault. Um, positioning issues. Yeah, if you live in an area where there's a lot of trees and you've got the RTK next to your house and the, base station is up under something uh, and you live in the in the north or in canada yeah you, you might have some positioning issues i live down in south florida so maybe that has a lot to do with it i'm always uh got, i've always pretty much always got full satellite coverage and i guess what i'm saying is is that i just don't have those issues I, this, this thing has been the best tool i've may have ever bought in my whole life so, with that being said, let's go change, let's go snap on the, now that it took me two months to get here, I could have used this thing months ago during the heavy rainy season, but now rainy season's over, I got it, thanks my motion, two months later, so I'm going to go snap it on anyway, and uh, it probably won't, won't rain here for another four months. Anyway, let's see how this fits. Okay, well, there's Larry down there, and uh, the RTK is right up there. So, let's crawl up there and snap on the cap. All right, now I'm hoping this only takes a second, but more than that, I hope that I don't fall off this ladder and get it on video. Uh, well, maybe it might boost my, uh, might boost my algorithm if I fell. And I'm getting up here on this little lean-to. Oh, it's a beautiful day. All right, we're up here. I'm getting too old for this. We're up here on the, on the roof of the lean-to. And uh, so apparently this thing just clips right on. So let's see how hard this is okay okay well that took what two and a half seconds make sure i got it oh no i gotta clip it on there yeah it's on there hmm. well that was that was too easy that was too easy all right well there it is y'all okay Guys, that is going to do it for the video. I'm going to put some new blades. I'm, I'm going to spin the blades around on Larry. And uh, I'm going to send him out once a month from this point on until next rainy season. Until the grass uh, comes back to grass and the weeds come back to life. So anyway, that's going to do it for me, guys. If you like the channel or if you like the video, please consider clicking the thumbs up button, hitting the subscribe tab, and ticking that little bell for future updates about Larry, the Lonely Lawnmower.